Hello my Beatles friends, welcome back to another video. Today's video is a bit unusual video. Uh, as you can see, I'm in a different location uh, starting the video. I'm driving back home. Uh, I just had a meeting with a very interesting man. Uh, this video is connected to a, a box set release of the Revolver album. Uh, which is going to be released on 28th of October. So in the meantime, I was thinking to myself, what can I do? So I took my original uh, German pressing and the uh, original UK pressing album covers and I went to meet the creator, Mr. Klaus Forman. Uh, he lives uh, not far away from me here in Germany and uh, I wrote him an email and he kindly agreed to meet with me. So I just uh, visited him and uh, we had a little conversation, a little Q&A. He told me a few interesting, th interesting things and some of them I have filmed on my GoPro camera. And uh, now when I will arrive home, I will, uh, you know, and in the usual mode, in my living room mode, I will start showing you all the items that he signed and uh, we'll, be, we'll have a little discussion about the upcoming box and about the books. And uh, I will be showing you the footage of uh, him signing. All right? So it was a fascinating meeting. It was a unbelievable moment, you know, with meeting Klaus Roman in person. Although it's not the first time, but still exciting always, as always. So uh, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll be back home in 20 minutes and uh, I'm going to continue my video then. Well, thank you very much and stay tuned. All right, so here I am back home in my living room mode and it's time to show you the items that I got today from Klaus. So first of all, <clears throat> this is the UK version of the cover and that's his signature. Uh, later I will show you the footage as he, when, he, when he signs it. Now this cover in my collection has a uh, history. Uh, a couple of years ago uh, this cover came with the uh, withdrawn version of Revolver Mono Pressing and if you watch my videos uh, the postman folded it in two and broke the record. There is a video on my channel when I show that record. And this is that cover that remained from that, uh, from that album and you can still see the crack here and the crack here. I mean, uh... so this one was without a record and it was a spare cover that I have in my collection. So I decided to, you know, ask Klaus to sign it and I will frame it. Also, he signed this one. This is a stereo German pressing on the uh, Herzu Odeon label. Now, I didn't have it until today. While driving there, I went to one record store in Munich and I took a spare cover with, uh, with a record, but the record is absolutely trashed. I don't know how people treat records these days. But I also asked uh, Klaus to sign this one. I actually asked him to sign only one, but then he said, you want me to sign the second one? I said, well, if that's okay with you, then okay. So here is the footage as he signs both of them. You left that white space here, especially for, for the autographs? <laughs> yeah, this is how he signed the second one. He said, okay, come on, give it to me, I'll sign it. <laughs> All right. This was the first part of our conversation. There, of course, were some other uh, um, questions that I asked him. I also asked him about the origins of those uh, pictures, that, where he took them from, the versions of the cover, and, and so on and so forth. The conversation was very very friendly very nice and uh, i was a bit nervous as always i'm uh nervous when i'm talking with celebrities and uh, he also mentioned that in the upcoming box set of revolver instead of his interview uh there was a graphic novel was used and that footage i will also show you after i explain if you're familiar with this book this book is called birth of an icon 
This is a 150 pages book. Now, part of this book, there is an inside a graphic novel. Here in the book, it's about 30 pages. <clears throat> graphic novel tells the whole story how this um, idea and how this origin of this cover came about. You know, how he got a call from John and how he was thinking what they wanted and how he was, uh, what he was doing. I mean, this, uh, this uh, book contains the full version of uh, this graphic novel, like I said, 30 pages. And as you're gonna hear right now from the video by, by the man himself, by Klaus himself, he reduced that graphic novel to seven pages and that, that uh, shortened version will be actually used in the upcoming Revolver box set, which I'm waiting already <laughs> with passion. Um, so, um, those of you who are not familiar with this book, this is a highly recommended book, very interesting book. And of course, Klaus Wurman has uh, many other items and many other books and CDs and graphics and uh, posters in his, uh, in his store. And I personally really recommend buying this book because it's very interesting. It's a full graphic novel and the short version, like I said, will be in the box. And uh, the link to, uh, to buying this book will be in the description section below. Now here comes the uh, short footage that I recorded while Klaus says what I just said. How you feel about uh, the box coming out that everybody's talking about it? I mean... Yeah, you know, the nice thing is that uh, I have this book uh, uh, with a graphic novel. And I told them, look, that, that, don't do an interview of me, just show them uh, the graphic novel. The one that, that is in a book? Uh, wow! I made a version of seven pages. Okay. Which is in the box set. But, uh, okay. but for the box set, they have in, uh, there's a booklet in there with a hundred pages. Yes, in, yes. And oh, seven pages of Are those hundred pages is great. Mine. From our conversation that we uh, spoke today, uh, he also told me that some origins of images that are still uh, still are unknown i mean most of the most of the images are robert freeman's pictures some other that's a hoffman's like this one i know that, that that's what i know for sure um, i asked him about this picture and he said that it's taken by astrid kirher when he was in his first band first ever band um also this picture origin of which is unknown it was given to him by the beatles and I asked him some other questions. So it was a very nice and interesting conversation. And I'm really excited even when I think about it. All right. So that was my little journey for today. This is the addition in my collection for the upcoming uh, Revolver box set. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed and uh, see you in my next videos. Thank you.